Okay guys, welcome to the Oz LSX Club tutorial on how to remove a uh, fuel rail fuel line using uh, pretty generic home tools. Okay, so what you'll need to do this job is if you still run your um, OEM engine covers or whatever equivalent, you will need a 10mm socket and whatever ratchet you want to use or wrench. And also a pop top lid of a pump bottle or equivalent. Now, this is how you have to modify it, okay? So this one I've had in my toolkit for shit, years, like four years, something like that. So basically you've got to cut the slot to go over the fuel line and also open it up a bit to uh, match the diameter of the fuel line. But that's pretty much how it will look. Okay, so I'll just pause it here and take the cover off and show the next step. Okay, so we've got the uh, access to the fuel line now. Now I'm just going to get the uh, special tool and slot it over there for now. There is a critical thing that we should do though before continuing and that's to bleed the pressure off the line. There's two ways to do that. One, you can use tuning software if you got it and switch the pump off there and crank it out. The other way and easier way in my opinion is to pop the fuse relay panel cover. Like at the fuel pump relay, which is that one. Pull it out and crank it out a few times. Starts, dies. Pretty much all the pressure is taken out. Okay, now I will try and set up the camera for this so that you can see this with two hands. Okay, so lines are now purged. And the idea is, is you squeeze the pop top lid together, get it in over the prongs, and hold the fitting on as best you can. Hold it in, give the line a push, squeeze it in even more so it goes in quite a bit, and then pull it together. And just like that, you got your line off with minimal spillage. Piece of cake. Okay, refitting, slot it back on, click, snug, done.